Hey guys, welcome to my video. So today we are at Starby's. Can you see? I don't know if you can see that. But that's where we are. And I asked you guys on Instagram what your favorite drink at Starbucks was. So I have picked six out of about the 20 drinks that you guys suggested. I basically am not getting a bunch of them that I've already tried. So I tried to get things that I haven't tried before so I can let you guys know what I think and also so I can, you know, maybe find something new to drink that I might like. So yeah, I'm really excited. They're all cold beverages. It's like 95 degrees in Alabama right now. Really cold beverages are what we needed. So I'm gonna go through the drive through and embarrassingly order six drinks. So let's go. Uh, I'm sorry in advance, I have kind of a big order. I wanna get a tall matcha frappuccino, tall ice caramel macchiato. Extra caramel drizzle. Can I get that one with the extra shot of espresso? A tall ice green tea latte with coconut milk. A tall mango dragon fruit refresher. What else for you? A tall iced passion tea lemonade. And then uh, the last one is a tall strawberry and cream frappuccino. Okay. And that's it. That'll be $25.72. Thank you. All right, so we're parked at my favorite place, TJ Maxx, and I'm gonna go in there in a little bit and I'll vlog that, but I got my drinks. So I'm so excited. So I've got two Frappuccinos and four ice drinks. So I'm gonna think I'm just gonna try an ice drink real quick. So this is the first one and this is Sakura Storm on Instagram, a recommended iced green tea latte with coconut milk. So. These are the ones I'm probably scared of. I have a matcha one and a green tea one, and I'm gonna be honest, it's not a typical drink that I would order, so I'm a little nervous about it. Okay, so let's give this one a try. This is kinda good. This tastes like a cereal. I can't put my, my finger on what it is. That's actually pretty good. I was afraid of that one anything green tea I'm like oh I'm not gonna like it but that's pretty good oh it kind of tastes like rice pudding I actually really love rice pudding so that's pretty good okay I think I'm gonna try this one next this is an iced passion tea lemonade from calf mama 15 Ooh. oh this one's really like refreshing I'm not a big lemonade person so this is probably not gonna be like a favorite of mine, but if you like lemonade and you like like tangy, really refreshing drinks, this is pretty good. Mm. I kinda wanna drink more of the <laughs> green tea one. Okay, I'm gonna try one of the frappuccinos. So Sierra Meyer said strawberry and cream frappuccino. So that's what it looks like here. I didn't show you guys the other ones close up. The passion tea one's a really pretty like bright red color and the green tea latte is such a cute green so cute mm. that's like a strawberry milkshake it's so good this makes me want french fries oh this one's so good mm. i think i've probably reached my calorie allotment the week let's try a coffee one no a lot of these are like refreshing drinks so this is the iced caramel macchiato with an extra shot of espresso cali style so i didn't know what that meant and apparently they didn't either and they're like i, I just told them i had to look it up so it's just like caramel drizzle inside the cups so you can see it's like dripped down so it's really pretty it looks amazing so one of my favorite drinks is an iced cinnamon almond milk macchiato so this is kind of similar and I'm sure I'm gonna like this one Ooh, that is so good mmm I didn't even say who recommended that okay so Maddie Maddie X Stevens is the one that recommended this from Instagram so that's all this is okay ice caramel macchiato extra shot with an extra caramel drizzle this is so good Mmm, that might be the first one that I finish. Ooh, I'm gonna be like all hyped up on caffeine. The next one's a pretty simple order, but it's actually not one that I've tried before. So this is a mango dragon fruit refresher. A lot of you guys may have tried this one. It is the prettiest like pinky purple color. And this is like what I need on a hot day. Ooh, that one's really good. 
I'm gonna put Kayla's Instagram a little picture right here because I don't want to butcher your last name or the rest of your Instagram handle. So this one's really good. This is very refreshing, very summery. Mm -hmm. It's just like super, super fruity. I like this one too. I'm really glad I'm doing this because I feel like now I have several drinks that I want to order like on a regular basis because I get stuck in my like I order the same thing all the time so I'm glad I can mix it up now I only have one more left and I'm silly Billy B recommended this one which is a matcha frappuccino so this is probably the one I was most nervous about I tried maybe like one matcha drink one time and I was like absolutely not I don't like it fingers crossed that this one's gonna be better I can really taste the matcha. Mmm. <laughs> oh. I'm really sorry. I don't I don't really like this. Okay. So this one is not my bag. It's not as bad as I expected though. Like you can just taste the matcha and then it's kind of like lightly sweet and creamy. So definitely not bad at all. I'm just I'm very particular and I don't know matcha scared me the ice green tea latte surprisingly really really good i definitely want to drink this one the iced caramel macchiato extra shot extra caramel drizzle is so so good you guys really all had great recommendations and it's only like my pickiness that makes me not like a couple of them so i probably won't reorder the matcha frappuccino and i probably won't reorder the passion tea lemonade i will order like passion tea though it's just the lemon part that i don't really care for that much the rest of them so good the mango dragon fruit amazing and the strawberry cream frappuccino so freaking good thank you guys so much for all of your recommendations definitely let me know do you want to see me let the person in front of me pick what i eat i know that it's like old at this point probably but if you guys are still interested in seeing it i will totally do it for you thank you so so much i did not bring my dad jokes with me so i found a dad joke on reddit <laughs> stopped by a roadside stand that said lobster tails two dollars i paid my two dollars and he said once upon a time there was this lobster <laughs> that's so funny all right guys thank you so much for watching i hope you're having a great day and i will see you guys in my next video bye okay yeah recording five minutes oh. 40 seconds oh no i got out my pants holy shit so look how this is my favorite huh the other way, bitch. Well, it's really hard to fucking keep this thing held here. Well, you know, this is a locking device, right? So yeah. you probably don't want to. I'm not moving, I just need to three point contact. Mm. Mm. But you like it, don't you? It's alright. But anyway, okay, so let's talk about. What? So you want me to be first? <laughs> let's talk about the universe, meaning of life, and why O Charlie's doesn't do delivery. Okay. <laughs> Shut up! You. The ice uh, caramel macchiato, extra thought, extra shot, extra thought, and extra thought. Extra thought. <laughs> and I can't think of one off the top of my head. But I don't know.